So my training in the off-season changed a lot last winter um, and it was really, really successful. So uh, I had a lot of fun and it really helped during the summer racing uh, season. So I'm going to be doing the same sort of thing uh, this winter, which is a lot of cross training, especially a lot of skiing and then really cutting back on the running before adding it back in again as the race season approaches. I think throughout the entire summer season I'm I'm really looking forward to the winter training season because that's when I can go out and do long adventures, train, relax and just have fun. So it's really is kind of like um, it's a really important part of my training but also that sort of like cherry I'm looking for throughout the whole season because that's the time of the year I enjoy the most. Yeah, I'm pretty fortunate actually that I've got a lot of top athletes in Bergen that I can train with and also my wife just loves to be outside and training so uh, her idea of de-stressing after a long week of work is a full weekend of skiing so um, I couldn't have got a better wife uh, for the lifestyle that I love and we do have a lot of fun um, getting fitter together. something that is really important to me that's probably the word I use most when I'm talking to other people when they're asking how they could train or how I train because really if you enjoy something you go out and do it more and then you get better at it because the more you do something the, the better you get at it so it's pretty much my goal most days the first thing to do is to enjoy myself make things nice to so go and find activities which I really I really think are enjoyable but then also the side effect is the, the training.